Dear future wife, I am writing this to you from a center of mixed emotions. I know it seems pretty early, but it's just the situation. The thoughts of you alone is beauty and bliss. Your glorious creation is a perfect chapter in Genesis. Who? To be honest with you, I am writing this to you because my heart just got broken by a girl I thought I was in love with. It's sad, it's crazy, it's the feeling I've been battling with. You can count one to two, two to three, C. I've gotten this love thing wrong a number of times and I'm tired. Tired of hugging the wrong arms. Tired of reading mixed signals like a CHM material. Tired of fighting trust issues like Anthony Joshua. And yes, I know. I know I've got to toughen up and all, but how do you toughen up when God lift us doesn't lift you up? How do you fight a war you can't win? How do you score relationship goals without God in the team? I am not a custom officer, but I'm bothered. I am not from a lorry, but I've suffered. I know I'm not supposed to worry, but I'm clustered. The common ground between standing on an edge and letting someone into your heart is that there's always a tendency of falling. I have once fallen in love. I have once fallen apart. There's still no type of fall better than falling into the arms of the Most High. Because in Him, I'll find you and everything that's mine. His light will find us and like stars will shine. I can't wait to see you because I'm not saying you find that. An estimation of how perfect or imperfections will be, like a warrior on the quest for questions, to tell you stories of God, of love, of light, and everything in between, to whisper into your ears that you are beautiful just the way you are, a Bible of mathematical formulas, to tell you and remind you that you don't need to find your ex when you find me, to tell you a hundred over ninety-nine times, like an improper fraction over and over and over and over again that God is the writer of this love story. So like while I didn't know that for now, let's just be pencils in the hands of the Creator. Just faithfully, your baby boy. Thank you very much for having me.